Well, hello, hello, how are you? Are you well? Good, good, good. So nice to see you, so nice to hear from you. And yes, I have brand new content for you. Today, in today's video, I will be showing all the presents which I bought to for my friends and family from Morocco, okay? Right, so let's start maybe perhaps with these things, which are the bracelets. And um, I have many different ones. I bought plenty because they are very cheap. But the main thing is that these are handmade and they are made out of old tires. Mm, yes from tires and from the leather seats and what else you know what else there is out of use it's been recycled and made into uh, these absolutely wonderful bracelets uh, leather bracelets and also this one and also I've got this one this one the a yellow one and then I've got these beads and I also have this one and some of them I will leave uh, for myself and some of them will be for the presents all right so these are the bracelets okay next thing as Morocco is very famous for its tea and honey and everything, you know, I thought it would be a big shame not to buy a tea with me. And this is Moroccan tea. They actually say it's from China. The Moroccans say it's from China because Moroccan uh, tea is actually mint tea and wherever we went to cafes and and restaurants they are sipping instead of sipping coffee they are sipping a mint tea and it's so sweet they put so much sugar in there but anyways i tried it i liked it um and their mint is so strong it's completely completely different than we are used to anyway this is a green tea which I bought uh, in Morocco's market uh, for my friend or my brother maybe, I think for my brother. I still need to uh, sort out my presents and see what is for what. Anyways, next thing. Next thing, you know, it's very popular actually to uh, see bags like this instead of plastic bags in shops and uh, in the markets they are giving these bags away which is like a fabric bag and so i guess it can be reused which i will of course do here uh, in latvia reuse these bags and so yeah i wrap this amazing thing in this bag so it won't break when i'm flying and look look how amazing this is Oh my god, I love it. I'm like regretting why didn't I buy more of these. They would be so great for the presents. Uh, you can store anything in there, starting from some peanuts uh, up to like putting candle in there and a tea light and things like that. Yeah, but I only bought one. Um, saving the weight in my luggage because I had limited luggage and yeah so this is for me this is not a present this is for me and I will always remember Morocco uh, by looking at this absolutely amazing pottery it's made of clay and this is very popular for them for Moroccans um, to make clay pots different sizes also the tagine pots as well I really would love one but they are so heavy it is impossible to bring it back with a plane unless you buy an extra luggage just for tagine dish which I wouldn't anyway so this is my lovely bowl 
next thing soaps i will show you the soaps omg omg they have so amazing handcrafted soaps and so i bought i bought some for the presents and they are oh my lord they, they are smelling so moroccany you know uh different um different smells like this white one is musk and then this gray one is uh sandalwood oh wow and then of course different smells here which i can't really remember all the names and flavors but yeah they smell almost like i can tell you moroccan typical moroccan smells uh, including these soaps they smell like you know the incense stick which you burn and then the room fills up with a lovely uh, scent and then you can meditate you can relax in that cozy uh, aromatic space and so yeah uh, even their soaps smell like that yeah it's very very popular right these are the soaps i will just put them back in the bag otherwise snoopy will start sneezing they are really really powerful smells so yeah can be used for washing uh, for wash in a bath or what i will do i will just use them as um, as a scent you know to scent the room also perhaps i can put in my wardrobe to uh, repel the pests and, and 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 insects you know things like that and maybe these can even prevent rats from coming in and mouse oh my god wow really really like that incense stick uh yeah so these are the soaps next thing next thing they have so many shiny amazing things in morocco and so i bought this one uh, a pot a little jewelry pot and the other one the small one as well so it's a complex it's coming in one piece so i paid just one price for two and yeah i i bought these not for present but for myself where to put my earrings in or perhaps maybe it's something witchy something really witchy yeah absolutely loving the color loving the shine loving the sound loving the size loving the shape loving the feel of them yeah so amazing as i said i wish i could buy more of more of more of these and others but uh, i just had so limited uh, luggage space so i could only buy these things and still there is some to show okay so let's get into this continuing with some scents scents uh, these small ones are presents and this one is for me it's a perfume it's not an expensive perfume but it's not cheap either it's just local perfume and uh, i really wanted to find one uh, which would smell uh, of the scent stick as well like you know the one you burn and then it uh, gives out the aroma yeah and so it has some flower um, 
essences in there but also the typical Moroccan smells which I absolutely adore and yeah I wish I could find words to describe these smells more rather than nice or amazing or Moroccan but uh, I'm just short for words anyways yeah and they smell absolutely amazing and you can put them on your wrist or you can uh, smear them in your clothes or your pillowcases or your sheets in the wardrobe and yeah it's got so many uses and these gonna be presents the small ones also the next thing the next thing Moroccan Morocco is very very popular uh, with argan oil they are making their own argan oil and they are grinding the nuts argan nuts almond nuts perhaps no from almond nuts I think you can get all sweet almond oil don't you well I I don't know I know I don't know that but the argan oil it's it's very popular in Morocco and so I bought three bottles one for me and two to give away to my friends and my family also the next thing what is in here the next thing oh my god wow so in these bags oh my god uh, so these are eucalyptus mint granules crystals wrapped up in a small bag uh, mixed together with a, like a gunpowder it's called gunpowder but I think it's a tea and so when these uh, mint eucalyptus crystals are mixed with this gunpowder and put in a little bag like this and then you give it to someone who has either bad headache or who has a blocked nose for example all it takes just close one nostril and breathe in this damn bag and suddenly you feel like a newborn baby you don't have any headache you don't have any blocked nose you can breathe normally it's a magic thing magic thing and so they sell these to the tourists uh, in these lightweight bags to take home to give away to friends and family and so it doesn't take too much luggage space either and so I bought some uh, to give away to my friends and family this is a very good thing and these crystals apparently they will last the smell will last forever all you do just rub it rub it if you don't feel smell anymore just rub it and the smell will return okay that's that next thing I will keep it in a plastic bag I think maybe I will show you one this is a tea this is tea and you only would need just one just one so you would put that in a hot water and uh, brew your tea and uh, drink it and it has lots of benefits i don't know exactly what kind of tea is this again i've forgotten the name but it's a very healthy and a locally sourced uh, foraged and dried tea and so this will go go as a present to my friend also what moroccan trip trip would be without bringing back a spice and this is um, again i've forgotten the name but this is the mix 
I have at home in a jar I showed you many times in my videos on my other channel and this is a mix of curry uh, garam masala maybe I don't know but it smells gorgeous and I am using spices a lot and so there will be a little bit for me a little bit for my uh, friends and a little bit for my neighbors as well so yeah spices tea what else we have okay not many left as i said i could not buy too much because of the limited luggage space but these are absolutely wonderful little bags from morocco also handmade again and and these i bought so that i can put the gifts inside and give away to my family and friends instead of me putting their presents in a plastic bag or a paper or something so i thought this is a nice touch and these bags wouldn't weigh too much and so i will have one bag for myself as well and there's something inside have i forgotten something oh all right i bought these as well for the gifts so these bracelets these will go away as gifts as well okay the next thing the next thing i absolutely love this one as well oh my god isn't that gorgeous isn't that gorgeous gorgeous I love it I love it so much because it looks so witchy isn't it so I can put tea or something in there tea's got a hole I can put things inside and then pour it out into a little cup or something yeah I think it's a very witchy thing and I am very grateful the same as grateful for this one so yeah kind of like this kind of like this yeah Look. And so this will also not be a present, this will stay here in my cottage for myself, mm, for me. Mm. This is gorgeous. If, if I could, I would bring these, many of them, to all my friends and my family. But, well, and last but not least, guess what that is a one more one more present left and this is a big item but it's not as heavy so i thought i'll buy it for my friend and this is a handmade african shirt a nice material cotton real cotton so yeah and this is it from me I hope you enjoyed uh, my showing off all the presents and all the items which I bought back from Morocco and yeah I will have good memories when I look at these items and also I hope my friends and family will be happy when they receive them anyways guys if I could I could just buy loads and loads and send them away to you as well but see it's not it's not that easy when you travel with a small bag it's not possible 
So I hope one day you will have opportunity to visit Morocco and, and see all these items for yourself and try them out and smell them and eat them and, and taste them and, and uh, wear them and everything. God bless you and see you 